What up, fam? And welcome back to our channel. I'm Dale. And I'm Jazz. And before we get into much today, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when we drop goodies like these. Welcome back. It's such a treat. Great play, fam. Come on, let's eat. Shall we pray? Father God, we thank you for everyone that is joining us today. We thank you for intercession, tranquility, as well as hospitality because we have been receiving an abundance of that in these past few days. So, we thank you for all the intercessors and we thank you for all those who are giving hospitality and don't even know what it really means to the next person. So in your son, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. What up, y'all? On the menu, what we got? Some ranch. ranch. You, Red D. Yeah. <laughs> Happy Fish Fry Friday. We got yes, fried fish, fried chicken, spaghetti, salad, and coin. As cause what people say. <laughs> How y'all doing? What y'all eating on? Let me let me know. Let us know down below. It ain't no Cajun corn, but it, it'll do it's enough. corn. It ain't fresh corn. Could you pass the wishbone? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want you to pour it for me because I just want a a, a squad. A taste. Just mm -hmm. taste. That's enough. I gotta have That's some taste. Italian and some ranch on my salad. Shout out to all y'all who commented on our community post letting us know what y'all wanted to see with fish. Y'all left a lot of comments. So we got a we lot got of ideas. Options. Yeah. This was the quickest though. Mm-hmm. Cause we was hungry. The one that just jumped out with the po' boys because we haven't done that in a while. Yeah, so y'all definitely will see that. That's also why we started to get back in the habit of cooking a lot more. And even trying to do our videos because a lot of options around these parts. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. That was you. Yeah, it was a piece of, um, of a crouton. I wanna make sure. Mm. The funeral home that processed my stepdad actually gave my brother a 50% off option to have like a ceremony, although he's being cremated. So mm -hmm. that kind of alleviated a a lot of the burdens that were on his back because although he knew cremation was, was gonna be the best option, he still kinda wanted to have a service. So it's like the best out of the situation. And it put his mind in his heart at ease. Mm -hmm. They wanted fish. I mean, they wanted chicken. I'm not gonna say I wanted fish. The fish was already taken out. Last night, mm -hmm. supposed to go with chicken Alfredo. Not chicken Alfredo. Chicken, chicken noodle soup. Mm. <laughs> we put some rice in our chicken noodle soup. Mm -hmm. I get what you're saying about. <laughs> we all discombobulated. Mm-hmm. I want this fish stuff. I think I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna put this up here. Yeah, I'm gonna eat this fish right here. You said the fish, I mean you said the spaghetti good. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I started to show you guys. But they went to the stove and I got impatient. And I just started cooking and it's kind of like faster for me to just start cooking. 
Then if you're by yourself, mm -hmm. kind of cool. She used some wagyu beef. That was a bad idea. You said I had wagyu beef before? Kobe. Uh oh. If you missed it, we did what well, I did. A video by myself talking about a virtual baby shower mm -hmm. that we're gonna do around the first week in October. We haven't completely decided on the date. Don't be so crazy. But either that first weekend or the second weekend. You tweaking up your um, ranch recipe, girl. Uh. It's good. Mm -hmm. I like it's something spicy. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say something spicy. And the kids ain't gonna eat that. I thought it was just me. It's sitting though. Did that because when we tasted it, it did not have that bite. It kind of bit back. Mm -hmm. I didn't know if it was an Italian. I did put some black pepper in our salad though. Could it be that? Yes. <laughs> I did sprinkle some that. That's definitely it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm having that to rinse. Mm -hmm. But it is still good. Mm -hmm. Thanks. You're welcome. But yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do it's a virtual baby shower, but not really a baby shower. We're going to play some games, eat some food. It will be live, of course. So make sure you subscribe and get your bell on. So you will be ready. Have a little fun. Mm-hmm. Make a few friends. We're going to give away some prizes. Not prizes. We're gonna send out some cash out. We ain't gonna need them. Stunt. But that's a prize. <laughs> it is. It might not be a physical one, but. Mm -hmm. Cause it'll be too much to go get prizes and mail them out. Mm -mm. Says you. With a baby on the way. And everything we doing. We wouldn't even have time. And people have to email us. Or Tell them what they want. Or not even what they want, but they I add their address. Everybody don't like to give out their address, baby. No. <laughs> some people already sent some gifts and we already opened them, but anything anyone sends between now and that first weekend, we're gonna save it and open it. All at the same time. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm-mm. That way it really is like a baby shower. Mm-hmm. Everything's so good. Gonna run up on a piece of fish next. I'm buying a little everything. This combination never ceases to amaze. Mm -mm. And we've asked this before, but who ate fish? I mean, not fish, but spaghetti. Spaghetti and something else. Either growing up or when you were raising your kids. We did it. We mm -hmm. always had spaghetti, bread, or sometimes salad was a splurge. Mm -hmm. We had salad every time. Because I'm trying to get a tempo on it. Spaghetti, bread, 
You don't know about your business. I kind of like dinner. Two hands. How many times I ate spaghetti in my childhood? Really? Oh, we ate spaghetti at least once a week. It was fast. Now that I said it did. <laughs> But if we had, not at my house, but at some of my friend's house, if she had some spaghetti, mm -hmm. like left over, it would, you would have some fish or some uh, fried chicken or something with it. Mm -hmm. Stretch spaghetti. But not as good. First meal out of the gate. Mm -mm. Nobody, we weren't going just cooking out a direct meal. Like, oh, I'm cooking fishing, spaghetti, or chicken and spaghetti today. That's a, that seems like a lot. I guess people say that's a lot of meat. But, it seems like a lot, but depending on the size of the family, though, it can be enough to appeal to everybody. True. Because we we're about to have five boys. Everybody might not eat. It might be two that like fish, three mm -hmm. like chicken, one, four. Mm hmm. Excuse me. Oh. And we're going to need to fill them up. Right. Y'all. So I'd rather just go ahead and cook it on the front end and plate. True. And the spaghetti is over. I'm still hungry. Mm-hmm. Spaghetti, salad, chicken, fish, and probably another vegetable. If you still hungry, I don't know what to tell you about it. <laughs> This is gonna be interesting, y'all. Like, they can eat now. Mm hmm. But the stuff they eat is minute compared to when they start turning into teenagers. Well, and Frisk, I'm gonna start a little early. I'm and Frisk can eat two hamburgers, y'all. Oh my goodness. This is gonna be crazy. But I will say that they are like men though, since that he'll take two burgers before he'll take a burger and fries. Mm-hmm. I agree. They do not have to have fries. Mm-mm. Give me the meat. Mm-hmm. He won't even pepper chicken. Mm -hmm. Andrew was in his, I don't know. He in a different kind of phase. Macaroni, mm -hmm. pizza, hot dogs. Yep. Noodles. Noodles, mm-hmm. <clears throat> Can I keep it simple like that? And peanut butter jelly. Yeah. Cereal. And they like tacos. Yeah, lady, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he don't want me and cheese. Yup. We love our kids. Because their appetites, although they change, everybody pretty much, they have their own little lanes. They keep us on our toes, y'all. Yep, because it's constantly changing. Mm-hmm. Could you hand me the honey? Mm-hmm. Thank you. And growing up, if one person didn't eat something, I ain't gonna say didn't nobody care, but. Didn't nobody care. Wasn't nobody. Making a whole separate meal for one kid. Mm-mm. You got what you got. So I like giving them the option to 
Mm-hmm. Sometimes kids eat better that way though. When they not necessarily have what they want, but they have what they want. Mm-hmm. To a certain extent. Because honestly, I would rather cook two micro meals mm -hmm. than cook one main meal. For and somebody not eating somewhere mm -hmm. and they still hungry. And especially when their pediatrician says, don't force them to eat. They'll come back to it if they want it. But I don't want to bank on them. Okay, they'll come back when they're hungry. Mm -hmm. I want you to go ahead and eat. When everybody else and eats. be satisfied. Then when you get hungry, we do something else. Mm -hmm. Because we all ate around the same, same amount. If you are hungry, nine times ten, somebody <laughs> else is, so we can do a, mm -hmm. a snack or something, and that way you ain't snacking unnecessarily throughout the day. Yeah, but they don't eat too different. No, we ain't cooking that many extra. But could you imagine, like when they get older? Man, mm mm. -mm. More. They're gonna be the only on cooking. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start showing them. Cause I'm gonna be tired. Oh my goodness. That's a lot but of cooking. I can see them They're like bouncing. Four course meals. I, about to, I can see them bouncing from culture to culture. Mm -hmm. Like one person saying, Ooh, I want some burrito. We'll eat that for dinner. It's lunch. That take like four hours. Cause. Okay. Mm -mm. You going to buy something? I want some in and out, but we'll live on that side. All right, let me press ID burgers real quick. Mm -mm. I honestly cannot wait until they're old enough to be able to go to the store. Like if they do want something and it's mm -hmm. on small. Hey, oh, man. like if we um, normally press 50 50 burgers, like 50% ground salad on 50% veal, if we miss one, can you go to the store to get this while we're in the kitchen already prepping and getting everything else ready? Because sometimes the stuff you need from the store isn't what's gonna hold up the meal. Mm -hmm. But there's no point in starting the meal if you don't have that component, you gotta leave to go get it. So at that point, they wild it. Mm -mm. I'm gonna tell you how to do it. But with kind of with how they are now, I can see them preferring you to tell them how to do it instead of you doing it for them. Is they ready to help? They already don't even want you to make down their peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Yep. I wanted to do it. I get sad. Like my mom don't even want the sandwich, not my. <laughs> I wanted to make it myself. <laughs> but that was something very good that she asked him on um, the shot. When she was asking him like, why do you cook? What's your story? Ooh. You know, and it's, I had a little food since I was a child. Okay. It's something they would be able to say. Yeah. I've always had an inclination for food. I've been, I've been trying to be in the kitchen since they would. I wanted to be in there. They wouldn't even let me. They said I was too small. <laughs> that still won't stop me. I still was looking. When we get to cooking, they be like, "What you cooking? Something smells so delicious." Mm hmm. I knew it was gonna cut off. Mm hmm. I was getting full anyway. You went to finish your fish. Yes. I figured that. 
They're very receptive young men. But show. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. This food was so good. I got crunchies all down my <laughs> on my belly from the crunchy fish, crunchy chicken. You ain't got, I ain't got that many. But <laughs> they got away. It was too good. I do want to finish my corn. Ah, ha, beefy. Mmm. I'm from the too. And I'm corn. You had a head start. No, I didn't. <laughs> That was just a whole coin. Mm -mm. That was a whole coin. How was it whole if you had to finish it? Mm-mm. Mm I just ate it all in one bite like you just it did. There was some pieces missing. No, it wasn't. Roll the bite. We will. <laughs> roll it back, roll it back, roll it back. <laughs> Also, that's why I enjoy different kind of meals over certain other ones because our energy be completely different sometimes. True that, true that. that is because food be, food be good, but like right now, especially with being a calm in our immediate personal life. This video isn't as cluttered. It's not as clouded and mm -mm. in this room. Better try your food. Ugh. Mm -hmm. You know how they got beyond me. Mm -hmm. You're beyond good. <laughs> well, thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed it. You're more welcome. Mm. Oh, my stomach is so full. Mine probably will be as soon, I was gonna say, as soon as I stand up from this video, what about the e I'm gonna be hungry. I don't know why. I don't know. Well, I guess because I'm sitting down, it's a baby inside of me. So once you get up and get to moving. <laughs> like a bird, excuse me. I make more room. Pretty good. What they trying? Sound like the old fans. Okay, we're gonna go, y'all. So sadly, we have come to that point in the video Don't where. Let y'all go. So until your next video. I <laughs> love you guys. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Be like somebody else to emulate because mm -hmm. you never know what. Your kind words and kind gestures might do for somebody else today. <laughs>